I want to ask about your relationship with Sir Alan, yeah. right? Because that's like kind of Laurel and Hardy or whatever. It's gone on for how many years? 30 something. 30 long years. Well, all my marriages put together. <laughs> yeah. Well, what? I mean, I've, I've done a couple of shows with Sir Alan, and yeah. I've got to say, he doesn't suffer fools, and he's absolutely worse than me at pulverising people. <laughs> but how, what's the secret of your relationship? <laughs> I think. I'm always entirely truthful with him mm. and loyal, mm. and I sort of get him. He's a very interesting guy, I love but him. very straightforward, mm. very straightforward, yeah. um, very loyal, very honest, and um, short-tempered, and that's about it. You get on with him and I can't. <laughs> <laughs> but, have you ever wanted to say something? Because I think he's, he is quite frightening, but, Nick, you must want to say something to him and think... How will this go down? I mean, aren't there occasions so, when you think he's not going to like this? I'm going to get my head bitten off. I am. No, I, I think it only really ever happened during that sort of Tottenham era when it, which was so fraud. It's a long time ago mm. now. But um, an occasion arose, and I said, "Look, please don't do that. That will be the wrong thing to do. I urge you, don't you tell me." <laughs> <laughs> I thought, oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but that's about the only time he's really yeah. snapped my head off. I mean, yeah. this is the ten series, isn't it? And yeah. I mean, it's, it's completely changed your life, too, and opened Absolutely. up incredible new opportunities. I've been I mean, very lucky. Yeah. Um, I mean, no countdown, of course, and other presenting opportunities, yeah. and also charity uh, opportunities. You've travelled well, a lot. I think, you know, that I've been so blessed 